I just absolutely love the roof line of that house. And I want to know what it looks like behind the wall. It is really pretty. All right. Hopefully we don't get in trouble for doing this. All right. Let's walk around over there really quickly because I want to see okay. if there's a little bit more isolated spot I can take off from. Yeah. <clears throat> Ideally, I'd love to buy this house and fix it up, but <laughs> something wonder, tells me that would be quite the money. Part. I wonder how much this would run for. I mean, I feel like the buying it would be physically possible. The renovating it and making it livable. True, that would take a long be, time, wouldn't it? Yeah. But it's so pretty. Alright, well... Um, we can probably go like right here. <laughs> okay, good. Because the the sound of the drone can carry, uh, so um, <laughs> when you when, it's like when you first take off is when it's the loudest because it's the closest to the yeah. ground. So I'd rather be here. Okay. Well, I got my uh, drone caught in a tree. Let's see if we can get it down. Yep, so it's completely stuck. And uh, <laughs> we're just gonna leave it. We're just gonna leave it here for now. <laughs> Gotta continue the video. <laughs> I was not expecting that. <laughs> I got it back. It was pretty windy that day, and Elliot went back to the same spot, and it had fallen out of the tree. So uh, I'm very happy to have it back. Unfortunately, it's mostly intact, uh, except, hold on, this wing here, it's a little bit busted up, as you can see. So today I'm sending this off to get repaired, and hopefully I'll get it back soon. Unfortunately, as I learned the last time I crashed this drone, uh, I am not enrolled in the Japanese version of the insurance for it, so I'm gonna probably have to pay like uh, 10,000 yen to get this repaired, which, you know, kinda sucks. Honestly, I'm surprised that it isn't more damaged, because like it was pretty high up in the tree, and also there were a bunch of stones on the ground below. Uh, like, I, I was genuinely worried it was just gonna get completely ruined, but it looks mostly fine. Anyway, that's about it for the drone. I only have one other thing this week, and that is... Rami's dad sent me his old bread maker, so um, expect some uh, bread vlogs in the future. Vlogs. So expect some uh, bread vlogs in the future. Actually, I kind of want to do a video on Japanese bread makers because, like, it's not really a thing that we had back in America. At least I don't think so. Well, because most people just have an oven in America, and well, like, this does make it easy, like, I'd much rather just have an oven. Anyway, um, I'm excited to use this. Anyway, that's going to be all for this week. If you watched until the end, thank you, and I will see you next time.